peace and love, African family, peace, love, and sunlight. This is Ankeru from VeganChoiceFoods.com. Come on in, family. Come on in, come on in, Ankeru. Peace and love, African family, peace, love, and sunlight. This is Ankeru from VeganChoiceFoods.com. Come on in, family. Come on in, come on in, Ankeru from VeganChoiceFoods.com with another mineral rich in iron nutrition. You might not know this family, but in Jamaica, we call this Susumba. This is Susumba in Jamaica. We call it Susumba in Jamaica. In Ghana, they call it garden eggplant. Growing up in Jamaica, I see a lot of this around the place. And the rest of them used to cook it in them stew. But you know, you know what I mean? Jamaicans when I respect Rasta. I we talk bad things about Rasta. They beat up Rasta in Jamaica. But the Rasta, the corner stone of this right now. So I know this because of the Rasta man them. When I come in Ghana, I see they use it in their stew. And they said that when people are low in iron, they're anemic. This is what they give them, guys. So I come here and I blend up a juice. I boil it and I blend a juice. And as you can, as you can listen, guys, it's live, it's active. Common sense, guys. When, you, when your food is on the table, can you hear anything from it? Can you hear it moving? If the body is electric, what does that tell you, guys? This is just common sense. This is just common sense. Just like when you blend up the sea marsh, it's the same thing, guys. The enzymes, it's live, motion that it's active. The body is electric. So why, when you, why would you want to give the body dead food? When you put it on the plate, it's dead. Nothing is nothing. You, you can you can hear nothing from a dead chicken or a dead animal. This is life. Plant is living. Plant is life. Even when the plant is off the tree, and you pick it, it's still alive. Wow. Third eye. Open up your third eye. I never got to school to know this. I never read this in no book. I never read this in no book family. It's because of the consciousness it's because i'm a third eyes open up i can look at information decipher it turn pick sense out of nonsense turn it into information give it to you so you can actually understand and learn and since i've been on this continent it's like i'm like amazed to see i'm just like it's like i don't know but i'm saying to myself oh i know so much and i never read nothing i never do nothing i just you know what I mean? It's crazy, guys. So, third eye, start with a cleanse. It start with a detox. It stop, start from stop eating man-made, processed, engineered, genetically modified food. Go back to real foods from nature. I'm here on the continent. And no Africans, no African in, in, in Africa. What they show you on TV, um, that people, you know, starving and starvation. It's impossible for someone in Africa to starve. It's impossible because everything is here. But the people mind are turn away from the food that God created for them. The mind are turn away, family. It's right here, family. I never seen nowhere in my life I can go and like just live not. I can just live. I can just eat natural food and don't have to worry about nothing because it's right here. Sure, and just sixty-five days worth of fruits. It's crazy. It's never grow. It's never go out of style. So as I said, guys, I just want to share this with you guys that, you know what I mean? Yeah, Grandpa from Kingston. Yeah, man, as I said, guys, trust me. I'm going to enjoy my juice. <sighs> Susumba. It's electric. You can feel it when you have... When you, when you drink something and your eyes start to run water, just like when you drink a coconut water, your eyes start to run water. Why? Because it's electric. It's live. The water is activate something in your body that your eyes run water. It's common sense. Basic health is common sense. Wow. So what does it taste like? As I said, guys, it has a, a bitter taste. But as you know, guys, once you change your taste bud, it will taste normal to you because your taste bud changes every 21 days to 
14 to 21 days to 30 days so that's the reason why we said the cleanse and the detox the change from the those type of food fruits juice smoothies so you change your taste bud to an alkaline taste bud so when you drink something like this and it tastes a little bitter it doesn't it, it, it feel normal normal to you guys so that's what it is but that's what it is one love jarastafari i'll be heading to ethiopia soon to meet the place of where jarastafari was created um so as i said guys i'm out you know it's crazy and if you want to come to africa you, can, you cannot just get up and come you gotta do something before you come now we are creating a system to show you how you can or you can plan and come and live once you create a system you can just come and live like that because you know it is what it is this is Anke Roo from vegan choice food so what it's our full tasting family wants a change but once a taste but is changed there's nothing that tastes um are, are full for you because the man-made processed food is sweet to the belly where sweet nanny goat are going to run in belly and as i said all disease start in the gut so if it's sweet to your, it's sweet to your mouth and it go down your belly it's sweet to you but sweet nanny goat are going to run in belly you know what i mean if all disease start in the gut and it's sweet to your taste but it go into your belly and that's when it cause disease family so all of these talks just come no couple words the world is made up of numbers and words so you need to change the taste bud change the taste bud family the taste bud needs to change so get the cleanse get the detox and it will cleanse out the parasite that sends signal to your brain when you have the food craving saying you want something sweet you want something this you want that it will change and that's what the cleanse are for you can go on an alkaline and a vegan diet without cleansing and detoxing or else you're not going to do nothing you're just going to eat alkaline food for a month and find yourself going out there eating when you when you crave when you when the worms enter it in your gut started to tell us hey i need a piece of cheese i need i need i need something sweet i need this i need that i need some dairy i need some sugar i need some starch that's what i'm gonna tell you and the gut and the brain is connected it's just basic health. What, what do you think of turmeric, ginger, shot daily? Um, as I said, guys, the ginger is good. I'm not so sure about the turmeric, but the ginger shot is good. Um, you can maybe do your turmeric if you want, but I don't take that. But you can if you want. But the ginger is an everyday thing. Ginger is very good. Ginger is very good. Ginger shot is very good, family. It's very good and there's other shot you can take other shot that you can take um this is anchor rule no more, more more questions so i'm going out